Hi, welcome to the channel. Today we are going to talk about the movie Knock Knock. The 2015 American erotic psychological thriller movie Knock Knock. While his wife Karen, Ignacia Allamond, and their two kids spend Father's Day weekend at the beach, happily married architect Evan Weber, Keanu Reeves, is recovering at home from a shoulder injury. Artist Karen hands over control of her sculpture that needs to be relocated to an art exhibition to her assistant Louis, Aaron Burns. The first evening, two women, Genesis, Lorenza Izzo, and Belle, Ana de Armas, knock on Evan's door asking for assistance finding a party during a downpour. Evan lets them inside so they can dry off and contact the party's host online. The females start acting overly flirty toward Evan and appear hesitant to go, so he books an Uber for them. When their driver arrives, Evan discovers them in the bathroom while they are still undressed. He tries to get them to leave, but they start obstructing him. He caves and brings along a threesome. Evan discovers the girls had damaged his wife's sculpture the following morning and urges them to leave, when Vivian, Colleen Camp, a friend of Karen's, walks by. She observes him with Genesis. The girls give up and consent to be escorted home when Evan makes a threat to file a break in report. When the girls break in and knock him out with one of his wife's sculptures, he returns them to their home, cleans up their mess, and tries to return to his job. The girls inform Evan that they are underage and that they'll FaceTime his wife if he doesn't comply with their demands. Evan tries to flee but is stabbed with a fork by Genesis, who then ties him to a chair with Belle after being tied to his bed and sexually assaulted by Belle who is acting as a schoolgirl while wearing his daughter's costume. Lewis finds Evan bound up and the girls breaking the Vandali's sculpture as he comes to get the sculpture. He begins to get an asthma attack and discovers that they have taken his inhaler. Attempting to retrieve it, he stumbles, smashes his skull, and passes away. In order to make it appear as though Evan murdered Lewis after learning of his affair with his wife, the girls turn Lewis's corpse into a sculpture and use his phone. The girls compel Evan to play hide and seek, which only serves to further abuse and afflict him. He tries to leave the house, but is stopped by Genesis and Belle, who are holding him at gunpoint and telling him that he will pass away at dawn, because they have slain other men. The following day at first light, they tie Evan up with a hose and bury him in the backyard to the height of his head. They laugh hysterically as they admit that the whole situation was just this game, as none of them were underage and neither of them had any intention of killing Evan. Everything they did was a part of their evil hobby, which involved seducing married men with children and destroying their homes. Genesis posts a video of Belle raping him on Facebook after which he and his dog, Monkey, leave. When Jake, Evan's son, sees the mess the house is in when Karen and the kids get there, Jake exclaims, Daddy had a party. In a different conclusion, Evan exacts retribution by using Monkey's GPS tracker on his collar to locate the girls at the home of another victim. The females call out when he knocks on the door, who's there? Thank you, 